up, what up, what up? Z Twister back with the YouTube channel. Listen, guys, please don't be mad. I know it's been a while. I know. I've just been super busy lately. What with, you know, sports, boyfriends, girlfriends, and basically just trying to keep my life together and trying not to do any harm to myself. Whoa, that was deep. I did not mean that. Cut. Anyways, I've missed you guys and thinking of how I've been so busy, it's led me to believe that I am freaking cool. And because I'm so cool and I love you guys so much, I have decided, drum roll please, blah, 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 to give you guys a lesson on how to be super cool. In this process, there are going to be three major categories. One is how to dress cool. Two is how to talk cool. And three, my personal favorite, is how to walk cool. So, let's get this thing started! First off, how to dress cool. Basically, you just need to get creative, all right? Like, we have the flannels, bleh. We have the, I don't know, leggings sandals, crop tops, ooh, and those little short shorts that show half your butt that your mom does not appreciate. Even though these are all great options, you have to be original. Mix it up a little bit, you know? You're your own person. Life hack number two, be yourself. There's only one of you. So why don't you just be you? Mm-hmm. Let's take a jump into my closet. Woo! Wow. Look at all these options we have. Color-coded life hack number three. Color coat your closet. It's really cute, really aesthetic, and your mom will be proud of you. But as you look into your closet, pick out something that speaks to you that day. Sure, you might want to pick out that same sweatshirt that your boyfriend said you looked hot in that one time, but what's the fun in that? What if your side hoe likes a different shirt? One thing I know though, girls, listen up. You can never go wrong with black. Let's see what we got here. <gasps> Perfect. I'm going to pick out some more little clothes and I'll see you guys in one second. Honestly, it doesn't get cooler than this. You got the coral that makes it pop. Hustle! You got the elite jacket and the white Nikes on to tell people like, hey, I shop at the Nike outlet. I might have money. Or I might have just used my mom's money. But you'll never know. And then you got the hat. Now, hats aren't for everybody, you know? But can I just say, damn. And never, ever, ever forget the dirty bus necklace. Now, if you don't have a dirty bus necklace, I understand that most of you out there really do not. It's kind of one of a kind. But just know, I don't make the rules. I don't... This is just a rule for all of society. I did not make this. But just know that if you do not have a dirty bus necklace, you will never be able to reach the full potential of coolness. Now, I'm already here. I'm at the top. Like, it does not get better than this. But do not get discouraged because you could get kind of close. I mean, the dirty bus necklace kind of throws it over the top. But, you know, it'll, it'll work. Anyways, 
moving on to number two. How to talk cool, man. The key to talking cool is to know your audience. Like if you're talking to your main homegirl, how about try um, greeting her with a nice, sup, bitch. And that actually can go for your dad, grandma, great grandma, I don't know. Might be a little too old for that one. It also helps if you make your voice lower, sexier, smoother, like a cup of chocolate cup. And it also helps to use a lot of bros, dudes, hoes, you know, just those nice pronouns that give it just a little extra umph. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll show you what I mean. Sup, bro? I'm the Z-Twister. How's it cooking good looking? <laughs> See? That went exactly how I planned it out to be. By telling Miss Mary, sup, and how was it cooking good looking, it made her utterly feel comfortable to laugh and to express herself. It also helps if you use hand motions like this when you talk. It's not all about the words you say, it's about the emotion and the haptic you put into it, you know what I'm saying? Now that we got that out of the way, bro, we're moving on to number three. It's all about the walk, man. See, the key to the walk, bro, is you have to act like you are having the best time of your life, bro. You gotta strut your stuff and be like, hell yeah, I'm better than you. I'm much cooler than you. And to show this off properly, especially if, you know, they can't hear your voice and your words, bro, is to use your walk to express your outfit, which is cool, and your words, bro, which are also cool. Here, I'll show you what I mean. Five, six, seven, eight. to it bro you know what I'm saying <laughs> and if you even have these little things oh they are perfect bro see if you don't know how to move your hands as cool as I do bro just watch this man oh shoot see how cool I look man you can be unstoppable just like this bro even though, man, that I've covered everything, all of the three categories on how to be almost as cool as me, there is still one more thing that you have to absolutely master and crush, bro, to even begin to understand coolness. You have to be 100%, no, 150% total, total, immense confidence in yourself. You have to look in the mirror every day and tell yourself how cool you actually are, bro. I'll show you what I do every single day. Bro, you are so, so cool. You make all of the other cool kids not look cool because you are so, so cool. You dress cool you talk cool and let's just say bro your walk is so cool your dirty bus necklace is cute no matter what anyone tells you your forehead isn't abnormally large everyone else's is just abnormally small bro don't worry about your eyebrows and how nobody can see them because the hair is so light Dark eyebrows are out of style anyways, bro, because you're the coolest and you create the style. I love you, bro. Have a fantastic day, bro. You're cool. Once a day, people. That's all it takes.
total coolness takes a lot of dedication. Trust me, it's not easy being a role model for cool people all of the time. Some days I want to give up and be like, hey, I want to pass this coolness on to someone else so I don't have the responsibility of it anymore. But then I remember all you Z Twister clan members out there and all the rest of you followers that aren't actually in the clan but just support the clan, whatever. I think of you guys and I just, I can't give it up. I know that to you guys, I am a huge role model, great motivator, motivator, and overall, an absolute queen to you guys, bro. And that's, you know, in the end, that is why I do it. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys learned something. I hope you guys just felt the coolness come through the camera and get into your little hearts and minds. And I hope you guys can understand that you can also be cool. I love you guys so, so much, bro. Mwah, mwah, mwah.